Hey, Abiding Presence, it's Pastor Steve. Hi, it's Sue. Miss you guys. And we've come to talk to you today about the financial uh, affairs of Abiding Presence. And who better to talk to us about finances than Sue? Um, when COVID hit us, we were very concerned about how Abiding Presence was going to be able to continue financially. And uh, thanks to your amazing generosity, we've been able to do so. And one of the ways that this was made possible was people shifting to online giving. We saw a dramatic increase, didn't we, Sue, in online giving? Yeah, we were probably about 40% online givers, and now we're probably about 65 to 70% online giving. What an amazing gift um, that you all are offering to Abiding Presence. Thank you for um, your continued generosity. It was the middle of Lent where we had to close down. We also had a Lenten challenge going on, a financial challenge um, to help pay off the back end of our mortgage. And so we were thinking, well, that's probably not going to happen. And you all um, blessed this congregation yeah. so much. Um, I don't know the exact number, Sue, but how much uh, uh, do you know the exact number of what we received in Lenten offerings? Yes, we received uh, $30,167. That is Amazing. phenomenal. Amazing, amazing. That's that's like ten percent of our mortgage yeah. right now, and uh, taking us underneath three hundred thousand right. dollars for our mortgage, and and uh, um, getting us closer to paying that off. I think that we had thought it was going to be August of twenty twenty four, and right. now that's going to be even before that. What an amazing mm -hmm. gift for the future of this congregation. So when COVID happened to us, there was a lot of concern. And that concern is now lessened, and and even more so with the uh, um, with the help of all of the lent and offerings to go toward our our mortgage. But something else happened too. Uh, we applied for um, a loan. We applied for the uh, Paycheck Protection Loan, which was part of the CARES Act that the government passed, and that helps us take care of at least eight weeks. And now it's extended. Um, to about 24 weeks, but it helps us take care of payroll costs along with benefits, certain benefits and some uh, utilities. Um, so we applied for that loan and we did get that. We received $107,000. Um, and so that will help take care of a lot of that for the, for a, uh, probably two to three months worth of stuff. What an amazing um, um, gift to be able to have as well. So this congregation is sitting in a pretty positive uh, financial place right now. Um, and the only reason why is, is because of the continued generosity of each of you, the members of Abiding Presence. Thank you for, for doing so. We have an intern getting ready to join us at Abiding Presence, and we are able to do so. Um, we budgeted for a part-time pastor, and since we aren't able to call one right now, all of that budgeted money that's been set apart for that can now be used for an intern. And that is a, an amazing gift that you all are going to provide, not only to Abiding Presence to have that uh, uh, seminarian to lead us in worship and teaching and, and so forth, but also to provide the greater church a future pastor. It's absolutely um, a, a wonderful, wonderful testimony that Abiding Presence has the ability to give so generously. Um, so thank you to each and every one of you. Um, and remember that you are the abiding presence of Christ in the world. And together we are seeking God and serving others in new ways. We just wanted to say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye.